of our constraints right here. Uh, icing. I can't read your hands. Ice, icing. Minus 0.4 equals 30. No. Er, it's less it's than or equal to 42. It's 0.4 is less than or equal to 32. Okay, and then the oven space is... P plus I is less than or equal to 140. The time is 0.15I plus 1P is less than or equal to 15 hours. Cookie dough is 1P plus 0.7I is less than or equal to 110. 450P plus 5I equals materials. Or er, not equals. That's less than or equal to materials. Zero materials? Is that zero materials? No, it's two guys. Is that just yeah. materials? All right. 6P plus 7I is less than or equal to zero minus profit. Or is that no, profit? That's the profit, profit equation. <laughs> what? All right. 6 minus 4.50 equals 1.50. One and a half P. 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 All right. 7 minus 5 equals 2. Two dollars. Two dollars. I. And two I plus one point five P is less than or equal to zero. Let's start with profit expression. All right, and we solve for I all of those. So the I sign line would be. Sorry, this is again. The I sign would be I is less than or equal to eighty. The Oven space would be I is less than or equal to 140 minus P. The time would be I is less than or equal to 100 minus 2 thirds P. The dough would be 157 and 1 seventh minus 10 sevenths P. And the profit line, you'd plug in a random number, like whatever number you want, and then you solve 2I plus 1.5. And then our graph. <laughs> we kind of like messed up on our feasible region, and so, but we found for a profit line, we found it was for icing, it was zero, and for the plane, it was 55, and we got a profit of $82.50.